Hi everyone, I am Dambo Demise. And I'm Beth Demise. And we are trading this weekend at Liverpool Comic Con. It's going to be a mad weekend, some incredible guests. We're here with our stand, our family business, Demise Collectibles. So join us as we take a closer look and see what is going on at this year's event. It's going to be awesome. Do not go anywhere. It's setup day at Liverpool Comic Con. Cannot wait for this one. And it's our last event of the year. Our last big weekender. So our last big show with, Nemo with Monopoly events. Sorry, I'm just mega excited. It's setup day. Putting the last few bits in the van and we are bringing as much stuff as possible this time. So it's the last event of the year. I keep saying that, don't I? <laughs> We've absolutely cleaned out the stock room. Everything, literally everything's coming with us. Even what's left, a pallet that we bought of mugs, licensed mugs, some great designs in here. We're gonna bring all these and sell these off at the event as well. These are gonna be four pounds or three for 10. Just some great designs, all movie, anime, TV themed ones. These will fly out, some really cool ones as well. There's some uh, King of Cats, Joe, Joey Exotic mugs. Some of them are quite funny. But some bangers in there, and they'll make great gifts as well. Christmas is on the way. Beth's just getting the last few bits ready. I need to put the jewelry wall, the jewelry wood. I can't even speak. <laughs> need to put the jewelry grid walls in the van. Do the last few t few checks, and then head northwest to Liverpool. It's about a three-hour drive, give or take. So I cannot wait to get there and just get set up. The fullest the van has ever been. I can't actually fit any more stuff in here. So we have completely cleared out everything that we've got. Final van checks are being complete now. Everything is in. Beth has been working extremely hard the past couple of days, getting as many Monster High dolls together as possible. As you can see, there is just dolls absolutely everywhere. Piecing them together, making sure the outfits are correct, they're all the accessories are there and correct, and they have to stand. That's how we sell them. We have to make sure that they are perfect so that you guys can get the best doll out of it as well. I am very busy, a huge delivery has come of badges, so I've been updating all the boards for you guys as well this weekend. I've got four boxes of stock here that need sorting, all of this needs processing and pricing up, tagging and bagging ready for you guys this weekend as well. Bye Taco, see you on Sunday. See you later Chica. No. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to Liverpool! All set and ready. Yeah. A weekend in Liverpool. Let's hit the road. And we're here, Liverpool Expo Centre. It's set up day, time to get sorted out. Started unloading the van, mammoth task. It's all good though. So set up day, this is what it looks like behind the scenes. Home for Demise is over there. And there's Beth. Dun, 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 dun. Hello! It is the day of the event and we are all set up here nice and early. Show you guys what we've got. All the badge boards have been massively topped up. We had a huge delivery of these just before the event, which was great. We've got a lot of Five Nights at Freddy's figures. Some wrestling figures, Star Wars Black Series. They've spent a long time putting some Monster High together. Just a great collection of collectibles, really. Star Wars, Funko Pops, Mystery Boxes, board games, Marvel Legends, minifigures they need topping up. Uh, we picked up some cool Power Ranger figures as well, some vintage Mighty Morphin. All set up ready for this weekend at Liverpool. So we're just walking around the event and it's absolutely huge. Like we've got here this morning at a good time, which we never do on a Saturday, do we? No. Usually we're like straight on it, no time. But we got set up pretty fast yesterday and we've got a little bit of extra time, but the scale of the venue, there's like three halls. Each hall is huge. The, the venue itself is absolutely massive. So you need a full weekend to get around it all. It's huge. Constantly up and down stairs and through tunnels and escalators and stuff. Escalators are on this time. Escalators are on. Oh, we need to go up here. We haven't been up here. 
This is the guest area and Beth is first in the queue. <laughs> no, this is the guest area before it opens guys, so later on this this area is going to be absolutely swamped. There is some incredible guests here this weekend. I will show you quickly who is here and I'll come back later when it's a bit more full to show you as well. Liv Tyler, Lord of the Rings, huge guest. Craig Parker, Lord of the Rings, Sauron gonna be sat there so I keep having a look anyone else that I recognize Jim Beaver will be there Elliot Page Umbrella Academy Neil Newborn Theo's gonna be over there Hello Jennifer Inga Felicity Day. So some of the guests for this weekend. There must be some more somewhere because I know there's quite a lot of Harry Potter guests and they're not actually on that row so I'm guessing they must be in another room. We'll have to find that one. I've lost Beth. Just found the mini retro gaming area. Fancy playing a game Beth? No. Got a little no. bit of time before it opens. <laughs> so, new school retro style arcade games. But then we've got some proper old school ones here. Really nice. Mortal Kombat. Old school. The Simpsons set is here, which is really cool. Homer, Marge, Lisa, Maggie, and Bart. His hair looks like he's getting thicker. His hair's getting thicker. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the gates of Jurassic Park. Behold. <laughs> Have you ever kissed a dinosaur before, Beth? All the time. <laughs> Platform nine and three quarters, you're gonna be late, Beth. Uh, owl's already going through. <laughs> Final preparations on the Daleks. Morning. Morning. Yeah, see, secrets, here we are. Backstage footage. Extreme wrestling is here this weekend. I will come back and get some footage of it, but here's the ring. Really cool. Yeah. You want to get in the ring? No. <laughs> I've just realised I thought it was a random teepee, but it's Hagrid's hut. Clearly, it's Hagrid's hut. <laughs> there he is. This is a huge prop build, it's massive. Really cool. Oh, they're like little hides and stuff. This is huge. Optimus Prime. Exhibit <laughs> a bit of parking pass in the window. But this is awesome, the scale of it. Absolutely huge. So there's loads of vehicles and props in here guys. Uh, this Beetlejuice, little Beetlejuice stand has taken our eye. Harry Potter flying car. The spider too. Hagrid spider. Well not Hagrid spider, spider from Harry Potter. So all the Harry Potter props are all together. This is awesome. We've just recently watched number two, haven't we? This is really cool. There's Bob. Bob. Do you dare say his name? Beetlegeist. <laughs> no, we know it's Beetlejuice, don't we? I'm gonna have to get a photo with that, that's awesome. Arkham Asylum Prison. For some reason, Batman's in there too. There's the Joker, this is uh, the Joker movie version. Love that one. He looks like he's gonna come alive and just move. Yeah, it's really cool. Nice prop build. Something new and fresh for the event, that one, and the Beetlejuice one too. And Hagrid's Hut, that's a new addition. 
this is one of the stage areas this is the smaller stage I believe doing a lot of talks and panels here later on Forest Gump Forest Gump this is a new build as well <laughs> oh this is cool really cool Stranger Things Hawkins Police Department so this is I've forgotten his name Hopper. Hopper's car really cool it's a big pickup as well and proper American style pickup <laughs> cheeky spider-man this is cool little com comic book style photo booth Batman, Superman, not forgetting Postman Pat. Where's the black and white cat? She's not really in there, isn't he? But he's not in there today. We didn't get the turtles van. There's a turtles van over here too. Quick, get over to here. Foot stinks. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. And I believe this particular vehicle, could be wrong, is the car from Supernatural. Beautiful, absolutely stunning. Not seen the Hot Fuzz one before. Oh yeah, uh, I don't know what this one's from. Do you, Beth? Hot Fuzz? I don't know what that is. Hot Fuzz police car. I have found the Harry Potter photo area. Photo area? Harry Potter guest area, so this will be swamped. Some huge people. Rupert Grant will be here. Ron Weasley. Jason's going to be there. Malfoy's dad. And Mark Williams as well. We'll be sat there, signing autographs and taking photos. Show you, this is where Miles Morales, the actor who plays Miles Morales, is going to be here. That is an amazing guest. Absolutely incredible. It has begun, I wish I could get closer guys, but I'm not allowed to due to security reasons. But there is a monstrous queue back there. Everyone's coming in now, having the security checks done. Saturday morning, early doors, early tickets, 9am opening time but they are letting people in an hour early due to that huge queue back there. Mega. So it is midday on our stand, Demise Collectibles. Beth is very busy serving customers. Just gone 11 o'clock. I've been quite a busy morning so far. Just wanted to show you this cosplay because this is awesome. This Davros is amazing. Really cool. And the back as well, check out the back. <laughs> it is Sunday, Sunday of Comic Con live at Liverpool. We will get a chance to do a little bit more filming today. Yesterday was just so busy, wasn't it, Beth? Didn't even get a chance to leave the stand. The stall was about three or four people deep all day. By the time we even like thought about getting away again, it was, it was almost the end of the day. It was like five, six o'clock. So today, I really want to get to the main stage because missed the Harry Potter panel yesterday. Good about that. Later on this afternoon, there is a Lord of the Rings talk. So I'm really hoping I'll get a chance to go over and see that one as well. And again, Beth has spent most of the weekend topping up stuff and I've been busy serving. That's literally how it's been all weekend, hasn't it? So this is Sunday at Liverpool Comic Con, Monopoly event. Home for Demise is over there. Deadpool. Like I said, hopefully 
hopefully it is a little bit quiet today but it's still very busy i really want to get to that lord of the rings panel i keep saying and the cosplay competition i really want to check out some of that because i've seen some incredible cosplay walking around oh look what we've just found hey just walking past, but can't get away from you, can we? Ah, uh, well, you see, we pop them everywhere, like a bad penny. Where's the sign? Where's the oh, Where's the sign? Right. The electric sign. I left it out. Unbelievable. Not a proper stall now. Wilsford's Fuds, greatest fudge at Comic Cons. Huge staple, always at the events, guys. Just some amazing flavours, like great prices as well. Slabs, huge slab for nine pounds, and they always cut you a great deal as well if you want a few more. Check them out. Who's collecting? Literally a stand of just Doctor Who stuff. This is awesome. Have you got a bigger stall this time? Yeah. Um, How are you doing, guys? Yeah, we're at Newcastle. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I thought we might as well here. Yeah, give it a try. It's always good. I do okay. Looks great. Having a good weekend. Oh, yesterday was incredible, wasn't it? I've noticed you sold that Dalek that was the Union Jack one. Is that long gone or is it still here? Oh, it's hidden down there, that's why. Yeah. Yeah, it's cool. It's a great collection of figures, loose and box. Vintage Cyberman there, that's really cool. Very nice. This particular stall is something I've never seen before, completely different. I think these are like customised shoes. Really cool. I really want to get in here and have a look. Hello. Just uh, admiring your custom work. Is it customised? Very nice. Really cool. Now this particular stand they're always at the big weekend comic cons. They just have a huge t-shirt stall and uh, the guy behind, I've actually met him a few times before, spends all weekend just pressing t-shirts basically, running around like a madman. They're always very busy by the looks of it too, but they do like printed t-shirts on the stall as well, so it's a bit manic, but they're a great price and some great designs as well. <laughs> been able to get away from the stall the panel that I want to go watch is already 15 minutes in so we're currently in the main trader hall literally got to leg it right to the other hall to try and get there to watch, catch a little bit of it and like I said it is a trek to the other hall the quickest way is actually to go outside and go around the venue rather than trying to walk through it because of the amount of people so this is outside, trying to get to the other main hall where the, the main arena is that you saw earlier in the video on the Saturday part.
So after racing back to the main arena, I got the times wrong and I'm, it's way past it. Like it finished, it finished ages ago the panel. So the Comic Con itself is clearing out because that was probably the main panel to watch as well. It is close to the end of the day guys. So pretty gutted really, managed to miss that. Uh, Keith Lemon was actually the stage host as well, which would have been amazing. So good, we missed the Lord of the Rings panel. No! We're gonna have to head back in now. May as well film, film some stalls and show what else is going on. In my personal opinion, the Liverpool Comic Con in the Monopoly events calendar is probably up there with the top three events of the year. The scale of it is just absolutely huge. The guest list is incredible. Like, me and Beth are absolutely worn out, shattered. It's also due to the fact that the hotel we stayed in as well was just, it was nice but a nightmare. Like, we were kept awake both nights, other guests partying and stuff. So we both had to have a power nap today, actually in the van, which we've never had to do before, taking it in turns. So heading back in now for the final part of the Comic Con. There's two hours left. I'm going to show you guys exactly what is going on. Show you some stalls. And that's it. Really like this stall. They were neighbours of, neighbors of ours this weekend. My voice is actually starting to go because I'm having to speak quite loudly all weekend. But some really cool stuff on here. Really cool. I mean, check some of these out. These caught my eye. Christmas style ornaments, gremlins. Really nice. It's good to see some different stuff. Goblin wood, wood of the goblin. How are we doing? I'm doing very well. You're you? right. Yeah, not bad, mate. Yes. Finally got some time to come and have a look at stuff. Nothing left on it. Yeah. <laughs> well, well, I know. Yeah. It's been a, a mad weekend, hasn't it? It's been good. It's been very good. Oh yeah, it's been great. Really good. Thanks, mate. This is the Christmas shopping. I probably will. Will at some point. Yeah. Like I know. I know. I need to get some bits for Beth. So. Yeah. Let's have a look. Do you like the potion bottles? <laughs> and the bags, the bags are really cool as well. Backpacks. The cushions over there. Not bad at all. Harry Potter wands. Figures. Mythical creatures, these look pretty cool, don't they? These caught my eye as well, I really like these. It's really cool. Caught my eye earlier, that one, and in white. I don't know what's better, the white or the black one. DNA, DNA toys. Our neighbours as well, our competitors and our neighbours, but we don't mind. It's healthy competition and we, we get on really well. We are good friends. Some really cool bits on here. I did see a Sauron figure as well. Is he still there? Oh, probably gone now. Cult Location Inc. What we got here? Are these drawings. Some really cool designs of t-shirts on this stall. Obviously the X-Men original one caught my eye, that's really nice. £12 a t-shirt. Villains. Probably the best time to show you guys because it like 
This is it, it's Sunday afternoon, there's an hour left of the Comic Con. Still a lot of people in, but because it's such a, a big size, it has cleared out rapidly. But it's nice, you can actually walk around, not at a snail's pace as it normally is, like penguins. Over here, are you? Hello. <laughs> How's yeah. it going? Right, mate. Mad weekend. I, yeah, it'll be good. I'm very tired now. Yeah, we all are. Aren't we? One hour left. One hour. Yeah. We got this. We've got it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <Power> <laughs> no, do you know what? Well, these are cool. Framed characters with a backdrop. I can't show you all the traders guys because there's, there's so many different trader halls, Artist Alley, I mean we've not even chance, had a chance to film a little bit of Artist Alley but that is here as well, independent authors and artists as well. This is the main trader hall which we're in as well, it's huge. And personally as well, like I said earlier, this show is definitely up there with the top three. Better, I personally think it's better, better than MCM or even London Comic Con. This one is definitely up there with the best. Oh, I've seen these guys before on Facebook and at other events as well. Dean of the Dead. In fact, I think the son of this star actually came. Hello. Hiya. You're right. Not bad. I think um, your lad maybe came at what, to, the, to our stand one time and traded a pack of the sauces for something that he wanted. Ah. That's how I managed to get some last time. I think. Sounds like something he would do. Yeah. <laughs> How's it been? Are you okay? Yeah, it's been a good one. You? Yeah. After a hint at my missus to come and get me something. Oh, so, I, yeah, I love this kind of thing. <laughs> Maybe Mary. Are you at any other shows or is this? Uh, LFCC next weekend. Yeah. MCM Birmingham. Then Hell on Earth, which is like a market. Yeah. Satanic Flea, which is a market. A local Christmas market. Then we're done. <laughs> Go. Well, got it online. Yes. I'll, I'll, I'll nudge it. Okay, oh, thank, thank you. you. See ya. Cheers. Yeah. Looks interesting. All sold out are those ones. Moon. These guys have a really cool stall, a lot of good boxed collectibles, really nice. Look interesting gold notes. He 
just spoke so highly of you. Everyone, I, everyone that I came in contact with seemed like very smart, intelligent, sensitive people. And I think, I think you will like this movie if you just give it a chance. I promise you, it's like nothing you've ever seen. And it's so this is some of the main guest area and this is the end of the day like I said it's still absolutely packed I came past earlier and you, you couldn't even get in this area there was just a sea of people what time are we now yeah one hour to go of the comic-con still a sea of people all waiting to see the guests for opportunities and signatures that was a look into the stalls I'm not going to show you them all because I can't be bothered. It's the end of the day. It's the last day. It's the Sunday. And yeah. But no, it has been an incredible weekend. Like I said, it's up there with the best shows of the year. Monopoly events are absolutely smashing it. Absolutely smashing it with their events. If you haven't been to one of theirs, then it is definitely recommended to do so. And we're almost there. We're almost there, the last push. Beth's still at it. The last push. Back at Demise HQ. We've survived.